Hello, welcome to the tranquil world of Fishing Planet. It was on Steam, it was early access, but it was free, so you're not paying anything at the moment. I think there's a, it's, it's a multiplayer fishing simulator. I think the downloadable content is, uh, you pay for that. But yeah, you, you can play it for free and just checking it out. I heard I heard one person describe this as as the Euro Truck equivalent of fishing, but um, I think it's a bit different to uh, so you go in the game and you can walk around. Well, you can walk around a limited area. If you go back down the pathway, the map screen comes up. Lots of stuff here. Uh, settings. You can change the render quality, full screen, anti-aliasing, dynamic water. You can change the sound volumes, the bobber size from your settings. And then you've got stuff, about, I don't know what, like that, back home, uh, your map, your inventory. You've got an inventory in this game where you've got uh, hooks and baits. Uh, there's a shop, rods and reels. If the backpack is full, these items will let you take more tackle along. So there's the shop. Oh, I see your, the amount of money you've got is listed up in the... Uh, yeah, the catfish basics. So there's quite a lot of information in this game. That's the rods section over there, spinning rods, telescopic rods. Uh, match rods, casting rods. And there's real spin reels. Cast reels and lines, options. Fleur line, braid line, tools and equipment, landing and fishnets. Uh, the other items are coming outfit, terminal tackle hooks. Uh, sinkers are still coming, bobbers, and lures, jig heads, jig baits. Insect worm baits, uh, fresh baits, and then there's licenses. California, basic California license. Wow, that's what it costs a fish for one day. One day, three days, week, month, or unlimited. 
in different places, so licenses in Colorado or Florida or Missouri, New York, North Carolina and Oregon's in the game at the moment. The premium shop is where you pay real money for stuff. Premium accounts, they're money packs. So you pay £2.9 Great British Pounds to get 500 in-game credits. Uh, what else have we got here? Statistics. Yeah, I've caught seven fish so far. I just had a quick go with the game. Fish keep net. Uh, there's a leaderboard. This is a multiplayer fishing game. So uh, you can see somebody there has caught, or oh, people have caught a lot of fish. And uh, people at different levels, people at level 21, level 20. And there's tutorials here. Tutorials for the inventory and for the shop. You've got to carefully choose your equipment before going on a fishing trip. Travelling. When travelling, you pay for the trip and for every day of fishing. So it's cheaper to travel for numerous days. The bigger the fish keeper, the more fish you can keep at the end of your fishing day. Pay attention to the weather. If the sky is clear... Fast forward to 8 a.m. If the sky is overcast, try 10 a.m. You can use the T key to fast forward time when you're out fishing. Okay, how do I resume this? Traveling. Locked. These all places are locked at the moment, so I can only be one place. Uh, da, 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 da. Enjoy a full day of fishing excitement on the Mudwater River. Couple of locations to choose from. And I'm back in. So you just go cast. And then you wait. Tranquility. And uh, I didn't do that right.
Okay. Let's just do that. And we wait. Strike was done too early. Now the time up in the top right hand, top left hand corner does say that it's only just it's five a.m. So it's probably not the best time of day. They tell you to fast forward to eight eight a.m. Five, six, seven, eight, so fast forward to three hours. Okay, it's eight AM now. I'll put a link in the description down below. And I got myself a bluegill. Yeah, I got a fish. Not that time. So this is multiplayer. As far as I can tell so far, you don't actually get to see the other players in the game. Well, I haven't yet, anyway. Yes, I'd imagine it could be quite relaxing to play this game. Ah, he got away. Strike timed out. Either <laughs> timed out. So what about the controls in the game? You just go, uh, you press F1 and you bring out the, yeah, you can choose rod, slime break, inventory, pitch on off, the drag setting, you control the reeling speed with the uh, mouse wheel, uh, there's HUD on off, you can bring out the map. So try again.
Yeah, got a blue girl. And so the game progresses. They get us in real time. I know you can advance the timer. I got another bluegill. Yeah, I already know that. Uh, and if the sky is overcast, try 10 a.m. Time advances real slow, 8.22 a.m. It would take quite a long time to get through an entire day then, I would imagine. So I'm going to pause the video and um, continue to fish for a bit. I will see you in a bit. So I'm back and I've uh, caught a couple more fish. I've gone forward in time to 5pm late in the day. There's nothing there. I can't remember how long the day goes on for now. This won't be a game for everybody. This fishing simulator. Pumpkin seed. Advance an hour, it's now 6 pm, and I'm still fishing. 
I don't know if the day automatically ends. Now 7 p.m. and it's got very foggy. Fish takes a bite. Eight PM. dark. I've advanced to 9pm and I'm still fishing. None biting. Fine. I go forward to ten pm. In that case. Um, I have something. Blue guilt. Now advance to 11 p.m.
too early. Your stay on pond has ended. If you wish to extend your stay for one more day, press extend or go home. I've got the results there. I advanced through much of the day though, and uh, fishing results. And uh, that's about it for now, I think, for uh, Fishing Planet. Fishing Planet is on Steam. And it doesn't have to cost anything, and it's in early access at the moment. So, uh, thanks for watching, and... See you in the next video.